I'm uh, Richard Rapport, I'm from Hungary and I'm currently representing uh, Romania. I don't really know what it takes to, to be a really good Blitz chess player. If I did, I would probably play it myself. I guess it uh, has something to do with being able to adapt as quickly as possible to the changes in the game, which are not that common in other time controls. Must have been around four years old when I got introduced to the game of chess. Then later on it kind of got lost amongst uh, other games, other board games. And I came back to it and probably never left it ever since around the age of nine due to a small mistake in a maths exam in school. I got in a four, which I believe is a B. I usually got, you know, A every, every time, but um, I didn't read the other page of the, the exam and my father figured it's clearly lack of focus, so the chess is very helpful to increase um, focus with kids and concentration. And so it began my career. You know, when uh, you're good at something, whatever it may be, and to me chess up to today is a beautiful game, so it still fascinates me in some levels. But of course, when I was um, kind of a beginner, let's say, it was more fascinating, you know, lots of unexplored territories and, and everything. So when someone tells you, ah, you can do for the rest of your life and you can make a decent living or whatever, and you might be the the best or one of the best in the world in this, and, and you know, this is all you will do. Of course, it sounds, uh, you know, amazing, yeah? It's like, uh, I believe if you would tell to a child, ah, you can have candy and all kind of junk food forever, yeah, you don't need to take uh, veggies and vitamins and whatever. They would be like, yeah, that's a good deal. So that's kind of uh, how it felt to me when uh, I was young and they proposed to me that I could uh, have my life in just Things that are, I'm very, you know, happy about or very memorable are, are more connected to my personal life, such as my marriage, because my wife is also a chess player and we met through chess. I have quite some, and you know, a few interests actually, I, but um, most of them are extremely boring. I just like to spend time uh, with loved ones and uh, have fun. Yeah. The only thing which I really appreciate about being a professional chess player is that I don't have, uh, you know, these nine to five jobs and, and such commitments. I have the freedom to, to organize my schedule however I please, so that I'm always free to, you know, to define my own routine, basically. Yeah, I am reasonably happy, and um, I believe, uh, okay, maybe it uh, sounds bad, but usually I am quite unhappy when I'm playing tournaments, and I'm quite happy when I'm home, so I, I believe uh, I am balancing it quite well. I guess it's difficult to balance because, okay, there's a sort of travel, and um, sometimes I'm barely home, and uh, sometimes I'm barely having a tournament, and you know, I'm home too much. You don't know what to do with yourself after some time, one way or another. But I believe I am reasonably happy when I am home uh, with loved ones and I'm, uh, I try to give my best when I am on tournaments and try to be as professional as possible. So I believe I am balancing it kind of okay. I heard other people describe my playing style but I never felt like it's accurate and thus I never thought what would be accurate <laughs> to describe it. I don't know, some of my colleagues uh, like to say I play very strange. So and uh, therefore probably my, the opinion, my opinion of what is the best move is... Actually, I think uh, chess is kind of a mini model of life in many ways. There are, you need to make decisions in life, you know, and chess is a game of decisions. Chess is also a game of um, arguments, as if, you know, if I have a plan, I have an idea of something, and then I'm trying to convince my opponent that this is a good idea. Probably my skills should be since I am playing chess from a very young age, from should develop you know, in these directions, in life and in chess. But I don't really feel like you know one or.